Thanks for joining us today. Got a question for you. Have you ever wondered how people end up in some of the situations they do in life? You know, we're often tempted to believe that people who end up in good situations get there because they're so smart. And the people who end up in bad situations in life, well, they ended up there because they were so dumb. But you know what? That's not true. In fact, there are a lot of very smart people who didn't end up where they wanted to in life. Proverbs chapter 24, Proverbs chapter 4 verse 26 tells us this. Ponder the path of your feet, then all of your ways will be sure. The reality in life is this, that your destination in life is not determined by your intellect. It's determined by the path, or we could use the word direction that you choose in your life. Many people in America today, they're on the wrong path. They've chosen the wrong direction in their life, and it's not getting them where they wanna go. But the problem is, they don't realize it because you often don't realize you're on the wrong path or you're going in the wrong direction until you end up in the wrong place. Proverbs chapter 14, verse 12 says this, there is a path that seems right to a man, but its end is the path to death. Here's something that I want you to write down. The path or the direction that you choose determines your destiny or the location that you end up at in life. Think about it this way. When you're going on vacation, you're not going to reach your desired vacation spot unless you're on the right road. So every day you and I are faced with all kinds of choices about which road, which path we're going to choose for that day. And what I want you to know is that the path that you choose today affects your destination tomorrow or in the future. You see, many people don't understand that the path that they're choosing today affects their tomorrow in every area of their life because life is made up of a series of connected choices. And those choices affect our finances, our relationships, our emotions, our careers, our family life, and our spiritual life. One of the most famous lines to come out of the movie Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade is when the Grail Knight tells Indiana Jones, choose wisely. For while the true grail will bring you life, the false grail will take it from you. Many people today are choosing poorly when it comes to their daily direction. And your daily direction has everything to do with your destiny. Getting to your destination in life has nothing to do with how smart you are. It has everything to do with the direction that you choose. So here's my question for you today. What path are you choosing on a daily basis? What direction are you deciding to go in each day? Are you choosing a path that leads to convenience and comfort and ease? The one that the world tells you to take, which the Bible says will lead to death, or are you choosing the way of life? Robert Frost wrote a famous poem called The Road Not Taken, and the final line of that poem states this, two roads diverged in a wood, and I took the road less traveled. Today, our culture is offering us paths to take spiritually, paths to take socially, financially, educationally, and politically that seem right and they feel good. And the masses of people in America are taking these paths, but I'm telling you that those paths are not gonna get you to where you wanna be in the end. So remember, the direction that you choose today will determine your destination tomorrow. Well, as always, thanks for joining me today. And I look forward to seeing you this Sunday for our series, Why Bad Things Happen to Smart People. God bless you.